Okay. Um, will this reaction have an equilibrium constant? Yeah, how do you know that? Well, that and it's in equilibrium, right? <laughs> okay, so it's in equilibrium. So it's going to have an equilibrium constant. What is it? AEQ equals ICL ICL squared divided by CL2 times I2, right? They're all gases, so they're all in the equilibrium expression, okay? So we could do our normal Le Chatelier's principle if we wanted to, like, if I added CL2, what would happen to the reaction? It would go to the right, right? What would, if I added CL2, what would happen to the concentration of I2? Decrease. Right? What would happen to the concentration of ICL? Increase. Increase, right? What if I remove ICL? What would happen to the concentration of Cl2? Decrease, right? Because it would go that way. Okay? Everybody's cool with that, right? I know it takes a little bit getting used to, but you're, you're almost there, right? Okay, but now remember we could also say we could increase or decrease the pressure, and that could potentially have an effect on the reaction, right? The reaction dynamic. Um, so, remember what I said, the first thing you need to do is figure out how many moles of gas each side of the reaction has, okay? So, moles are given to you by the relative moles, right, are given by the coefficients, okay? So, how many moles of chlorine gas do we have in this reaction, relatively? One. One. And how many moles of iodine gas? One. One. And how many moles of... I, C, O. Two. Two. So, which side has more moles of gas relatively? Neither one, right? Neither one. Why? Why? Because one plus one equals two. For those of you who are feign confused, you know, feigning confusion. Um, I know you can do one plus one. I know that for a fact. Okay, so, anyways. Um, hopefully everybody realized this is kind of a trick question, right, already. But what would happen if I decrease the pressure, or decrease the pressure, as they say, to this reaction? Nothing. What would happen if I increase the pressure? Nothing. It wouldn't push it either way. Why? Because there's two moles on both sides, relatively, okay? So, it doesn't favor, it doesn't favor to go from two to two, or from two to two, they're the same, you know? So, increasing the pressure or decreasing the pressure will keep the equilibrium constant the same. So you cannot, you know, change the concentration of products. You can't get more products by, you know, decreasing or increasing the pressure. Is everybody okay with that one? Okay, so I think that's about the end of our discussion of Le Chatelier's principles. So.